Thank you for tuning in to the third edition of our webcast series on misconceptions about retirement planning. Our previous videos explained how to analyze Hong Kong Mandatory Provident Fund (MPF) performance and provided insights on MPF fees and charges. In this edition, we focus on the importance of post-retirement investing. There is a common misconception that retirement saving ends at retirement. In fact, retirees should continue to invest even after they have retired, as there are a number of factors that may negatively impact retirement savings. First of all, increasing life expectancy of Hong Kong people means that Hong Kong residents, on average, need their retirement assets to last longer. To illustrate this. Let's look at the Hong Kong's demographic trend. Hong Kong has one of the highest life expectancies in the world, which is expected to increase further in the future. With higher life expectancy, the population of people over the age of 65 is also expected to increase, reaching 36% by 2064. In fact, a male retiree in 2064 is expected to live 5.8 years longer than a male retiree in 2014. Whilst living longer is a blessing, it also presents a financial challenge, as retirees will need their retirement assets to last for a longer period of time. Another factor that we should consider when planning for our retirement is inflation. Over a long period of time, Inflation will erode real purchasing power as goods and services gradually become more expensive. For example, the fare of an MTR ticket from Central to Mong Kok has increased from $2.50 in 1980 to $13.50 in 2016. This illustrates why people need to factor in inflation when saving towards retirement and are encouraged to continue investment post-retirement to enjoy a greater sense of financial security in their later years. As we have just seen, taking inflation and life expectancy into account, retirees may need to look for more sources of income to fund their retirement before and during retirement, such as post-retirement investments. Assume your retirement starts at age 65 with 2 million Hong Kong dollars in assets. If you begin withdrawing monthly, starting with 10,000 Hong Kong dollars from the first month and increasing the withdrawal amount by 1.65% per year to match the annual inflation rate, guess how many years can the assets last with different levels of post-retirement investment returns? This chart illustrates how a person's retirement fund may benefit by staying invested post-retirement. In this example, a retirement fund with no investment will last 14 years, whilst investment returns of 3 and 5% per annum could extend the longevity of your retirement assets by 4 and 10 years respectively. Overall, there are numerous factors that could unexpectedly erode our retirement assets, such as inflation and increasing life expectancy, which we have highlighted in this video. Therefore, Post-retirement investing can be key for investors wishing to have enough assets to help meet our increasing retirement needs. That concludes the third edition of our Misconceptions about Retirement Planning series. Thank you for watching.